Yo, what is going on YouTube? My name is Bjorn from Bjorn.com and welcome back to this video where I will be well sharing with you guys a tip. Now, quick disclaimer before I talk about today's topic, tip. It is not a formal advice, it is something that I have recently came across from my students, my friends, my partners, my mentors. And I just thought, hey, you know, they raised a good point and I want to share it with you guys, my audience. And yeah, however you want to perceive it, you know, do challenge my thoughts on this. Again, it is my opinion and I would love to hear yours as well in the comment section down below. So do engage with me, challenge my opinion and let's have a, you know, healthy, constructive discussion in the well, comment section down below. All right, so... Today, I want to share with you guys these five important things that you need to be successful. Five. All right, so I'm going to refer to my, my computer over on my uh, right hand side. Well, to you guys, I think it's yeah, it's right, right hand side because I, I can't remember everything, but I, I did write it down as, as a reminder for myself as well that I need this to make anything work, to be successful. I need it. That is why as an active practitioner of what I I, I, I speak, I, I communicate I, and I talk about it. I, I have no idea why cat is catching, catching my tongue today, damn it. <laughs> but these five things, right? So let's talk about it. These five things is gonna be money, time, attention, commitment, and faith. It's gonna be, I'm gonna you know, not go too in depth because this video is gonna be overly long. But I'm just gonna give you guys the main point as to why these five things are important for anyone, right? So number one, money. Let's be real, right? Let's be real. To make, uh, to make money, you need to spend money. Now, if you guys do not understand this statement, then you let me just quickly share with you guys, okay? Nothing, or rather, there is no free meal in the in the entire world. No such thing. Right, someone have to spend time, experience, money to make something work. Literally anything. Me recording this video, I'm spending time. And I would feel it is right for me to get something in return. Right? Your mentors, your role models, they spend time. If not time and money to market to you. They are branding. Naturally, they need to have something in return for them to stay profitable. Right? Again, you need to spend money to make more money. So time is definitely important. So for my uh, friends who are just watching or just coming up in the online industry, I understand that you do not have you know, maybe a lot of money to spend on something else because with your job and, and your family, you have limited resources that you can spend. Completely understand. That is why there are many, and I mean many, super affordable newbie programs in your respective niche. I can assure you that. Health and fitness, fitness, excuse me, crypto, property, make money online, affiliate marketing, e-commerce, whichever it is, there is definitely an affordable uh, pricing for you guys. And I do mean that because I, I know. On the contrary, there is a lot of you know, uh, rotten eggs in this industry, regardless of the niche. So be aware, right? Do be aware and be careful before spending your hard earned money, no matter how little or how much, right? A waste is a waste. And I do not want you guys to fall into the trap of shiny object syndrome, which again, I talk a lot about it, our SOS, do good click onto my channel, search the top bar somewhere, and, and, right, and just type SOS, shiny object syndrome, how to overcome it, right? So money is important to, well, be successful. That's a fact. That's a fact, right? Next is time, all right? So time, again, it, it ties in with money more often than not. You either spend time or you spend money or you spend both. And we do not want to trade time for money. You will, you will have heard this before. Trading time for money is the worst investment ever. You will want to have your money work for you so you don't have to spend any time for your wealth to grow. Time also deals with the amount of patience that you have in doing something. Because as, as this famous saying goes, time will tell. And that's true. You, you should not and you do not want to have overnight success because if you have overnight success, right? You may jolly well not know how to 
do anything about it. And give and this another thing comes in where given give someone a complete novice the best two in the world, they will never be able to fully utilize it to its fullest extent. The same goes here. Right? And for any entrepreneurs, any role model that you see online or anywhere, and think and you've ever thought to yourself, man, he or she is an overnight success. That is why you know they are at where they are today. Maybe to a certain degree that can be true. But more often than not, they have definitely spent countless of hours behind their desk, be, behind something working their butts off to get to this overnight success and I can assure you so I, I, I'm not a super successful per se but it took me countless of midnight hours to just get a little bit of well branding online and that is something that people will never see and even when spoken they may not truly believe that's the fact so when it comes to wanting to make anything work or be successful, time is definitely important, right? Now next is attention. Again, I talked about this very recently and I have been seeing it a lot, especially in my own high ticket course. Attention is the greatest asset mentioned by, well, Gary Vee. So attention basically is how, you know, it's eyeballs, right? They're eyeballs, they're traffic, eyeballs to your product. If you can get your dream customer's attention, would they be more likely to, you know, get or purchase anything that you wish to offer them? Most likely, yes. Would, would they be more likely to take a certain form of action than most other people? Most likely, yes. Because you have their attention. So when it comes to anything, business, any niche, marketing, any niche, you need to have a way to grab your audience's attention and if you can't do that then you know you can have the best tools the best program but if no one gives leave bets and eyelid on it it's gonna go to waste so attention well aka traffic is literally the lifeblood of your business do note that now commitments this is a bit of a uh common sense but i believe it has to be well spoken about commitment if you aren't committed to your craft you will never see how what is the potential that lies within it i would like to use this example to i like to use examples if you guys haven't uh, really already noticed but let's just use examples right commitment and it's like a tree a tree doesn't grow strong overnight it takes months, years, days, countless of hours for that one little tiny seed to blossom into something that is either beautiful, either strong, either overtowering, or a combination of everything. It takes commitment. Same for your business. That it doesn't matter which niche, which industry, if you are not committed then by all means you shouldn't expect any form of success right there is no shortcut if I may there is no garish quick scheme there, there simply isn't any form of a garish quick scheme is either too good to be true or there's a lot of hard work placed behind that program or blueprint that they summarize for you guys and you still have to put in the work you have to stay committed to the craft to make it work that is why commitment simply doesn't run away you have to commit to see results and the final point is something that i didn't believe in i'm not a fan of it but it's this thing of faith you have to have a little faith this is the only thing that you do not have control over, right? You can have the resources, you can have the best blueprint, you can have the best mentor, but whatever happens or whatever will happen, will happen. Murphy's Law, right? So 
all you can do once you feel prepared you feel you know that you have done everything right in the books under the sun all you gotta do is have a little faith and that is where a lot of entrepreneurs who had faith and of course with a certain a certain level of certainty see results and that's why the other half don't they do not have faith they are what we call the half the half empty cup kind of people that's a mistake having a little faith doesn't hurt of course don't be overconfident don't be complacent just have a little faith and i'm sure it will go a long way for you guys all right so that is basically the five things that you have to invest in right investment doesn't always re relates to money of anything financial it doesn't have to be i talk about it faith commitment time doesn't deal with money at all right it doesn't deal with money so this is something that you guys will want to know and i hope the message has been gotten across to you guys right that these five important things is really all you need to be successful or to make anything work online offline anywhere else and i hope you guys well find this valuable right so thank you guys for watching this video i hope you guys enjoyed my video if you guys did i will be sure to like share and subscribe as always feel free to comment let me know your thoughts i would love to hear what you have to say and it really means a lot for me do you guys are watching to the end and of course you know since you already watched to the end again might as well give me a like share subscribe check out my other videos and i as i upload reviews tips tutorials and so many more so do check out my content in my channel all right so until next time i hope everybody have a nice day stay safe stay healthy and i'll speak to you guys in my next one cheers